Ready right to pose for the ninth race. This is the third division of the two year old Colt Trot Tompkin Gear, sponsored by Shelly and Sands Incorporated. When play show exact to try effect wagering, scratch the four, CC, love that red, sick, leaving us a field of seven to go postward. Number one is Mr. Springer, owned by Robert Miller of Laburn, Kentucky, trained and driven by Kurt Sugg. Number two is Bankers Lane, owned by the Doug Ackerman Stables Incorporated of LaPorte, Indiana, trained by Doug J. Ackerman with D.R. Ackerman at the lines. Number three is Polar Winner, owned by Robert Key of Leechburg, Pennsylvania, trained by Jim Artledge Jr. Brett Miller is up the four, CC, love that red, sick. Scratch the four, CC, love that red, sick. The five is King Tut coming, owned by the Flowing Mineral Farm of Beach City, Ohio, trained and driven by Jim Smith. Number six is Le Canard, owned by the Steiner Stock Farm of Lima, Ohio, trained by Marty Willem. Dave Hawk is up the seven is Rock and Roll Cosmos, owned by Rex Lee Parker of Moore, Ohio, trained and driven by Norm Parker. And for the outside of the eight is Balanced Cruiser, owned by Shirley Shand of Penns Grove, New Jersey, trained by Kenneth Shan. Tyler Stillings is in the sunky. Here, sponsored by Shelly and Sands, down to a field of seven with a scratch of the four. CC, love that red, sick. From the rail out, Mr. Springer, Bankers Lane, Polar Winner, King Tut coming, Le Canard, Rock and Roll Cosmos on the outside, Balance Cruiser. Field into the back stretch, field in motion. They're all fan trotting in a very nice start here in between horses. There goes the five horse King Tut coming, who is firing out for command. Right alongside that is Bankers Lane coming away, trotting in third. That is Luke Kennard away racing in fourth. That is Mr. Springer. And off stride went King Tut coming, who is on a break. King Tut coming, who is on a break and now back down trotting there. As they trot around the first turn and over to the opening quarter and on top of the field, Bankers Lane has inherited the lead here. But look at Arden Dave Hawk with the outside is trotting in two. Mr. Springer trots in third. Off strike to win Polar Winner as well. They reach the opening quarter in 32 and three fifths and they'll trot by the stands for the first time and head on down to the half. Bankers Lane and D.R. Ackerman on the front end here, leading it by two and a half. To the inside, look at Arden is now tracking from the garden spot in two. Mr. Springer trots in third. Fourth, that is Rock and Roll Cosmos. Fifth, that is Balance Cruiser and Ty Stilling. Sixth along the rail, that is King Tut coming in seventh and trailing the field. That is Polar Winner. As they trot around the clubhouse, turning on over to the half in front of the paddock. On top of the field, Bankers Lane is calling the shots here, but now up on the outside, here comes the punter's choice, Mr. Springer. They're at the half. They're halfway home at a pedestrian 105 flat. Off the turn and driving down the backside in Bankers Lane. With the lead here, will be mighty tough to catch off these fractions. Mr. Springer has joined him along side trotting in two. Second over the outside trotting in third. That is Rock and Roll Cosmos along the rail at fourth. That is Luke Canard to the inside racing in five. That is Balance Cruiser to the outside trotting in six. That is King Cut coming and seventh along the rail. That is Polar Winner as they trot towards three quarters. Three quarters on the board in 135 and one fifth. Backside 30 and one. On to the front end and on top. Bankers Lane with the lead. But up on the outside, Mr. Springer is trying to wear him down and making a bad break there was Rock and Roll Cosmos as they turn to the top of Heartbreak Lane. Less than an eighth of a mile to go and down the stretch they come to the inside. Bankers Lane and D.R. Ackerman's looking for his third win of the night to the outside. Mr. Springer will take one more shot at him coming to the wire. Bankers Lane, Mr. Springer. D.R. Ackerman's got his third one of the night with Bankers Lane. Finishing second of the mile was the one, Mr. Springer. Third was the five, King Tut coming. The time of the mile, 2.05. One the first career victory for Bankers Lane. Track side of the winner's circle and be greeted by Chrissy Fount as she has done throughout the evening. There's the two, Bankers Lane. A two-year-old bait colt by Primrose Lane out of a KT Banker. She by Wall Street Banker. Owned by the Doug Ackerman Stables Incorporated of LaPorte, Indiana. Trained by Douglas J. Ackerman. Nicely handled here this evening by D.R. Ackerman. For Team Ackerman, they are, have now swept the three divisions of the two-year-old Colt Trot Tompkin Gears. This one with Banker's Lane, 205 one fifth First career victory. In the winner's circle, making the trophy presentation on behalf of Shelly and Sands, the sponsors of the ninth race, third division two-year-old Colt Trot, Tompkin Gears, the president and general manager, Ed Ryan. Ten, there remains no changes. A field of seven to go to the post here at 10.40, less than nine minutes away. 